So for this team, we're using Purple Yam, Finn, Black Pearl, Captain Caviar, and Unicorn Cookie. As far as treasures, we have Revive Feather, Attack Scroll, and also the lovely Cooldown Claw. As far as toppings, guys, on Purple Yam, we are running full almond with a focus on damage resist and at least 3.5% cooldown uh, so we can make sure the timings are all right and everything like that. For Finn, we are running full cooldown. Uh, we want to make sure we have at least 20% cooldown with 14% damage resist. It just basically, as soon as you get 20%, just pump it up. Pump up the damage resist as much as you can. But make sure you get that 20% first. For my boy Captain Caviar Cookie, we are running three raspberries with two almonds with a main focus on damage resist and cooldown. The main purpose we're for here for this is we want to make sure his attack is higher than Black Pearl's attack. So he is getting the buff from Finn. Really, you want as much cooldown as possible on, the, on Captain Caviar. Unfortunately, I don't have that many cooldown pieces for this. So we're we'll at the work with what we have. But you do want more cooldown. On Black Pearl Cuckoo, we are running a mix of almonds and also uh, swift chocolate. So the main focus here is going to be damage risk and cooldown. You want at least 16% cooldown uh, with as much damage risk as you can give. As you can see, I have 17.2 cooldown and 31.5% damage risk. So that should be good enough for this. And for Unicorn, we are doing the same thing, except we're running three almonds and two swift chocolates instead of the... Uh, the reverse that we had on Black Pearl. Uh, but on this, we are doing a focus on damage risk and cooldown with at least 15% cooldown if you can, and then focus on damage risk after that. 